What's going on, everybody? Hope everybody had a great weekend, and I hope y'all having a great day. Today, we're going to be going over how you can make tons and tons of unlimited stubs leading up to the roster update in MLB The Show 22. If you are OG on the channel, go ahead, comment down below. Let's fight the algorithm. Anybody that's new to the channel, welcome to the fam. Let's get into the breakdown. If you want to complete every collection super, super fast, head over to my sponsor and use code FAT for 5% off your order. Super fast and reliable. Now, this method is going to help you no money spent. Make unlimited stubs so you can go ahead and get Jackie Robinson. You can go ahead and get the 99 George Bretts and anybody else that you would like throughout the game. Now, all the OGs in the Discord know exactly what I'm talking about. We always conversate, but let's get right into today's breakdown on how you can make unlimited stubs leading up to the roster update. Now, the number one thing we're going to go over is the mini seasons method. Now, this is not how you're going to be making the stubs, but inside this mini seasons, if you go right here and you score 10 or more runs in a single game on rookie difficulty, as soon as you get 10 runs, you exit out, you're going to get a headliners choice pack set 10. In that headliners pack, you're either going to get something super, super glitchy, or you're going to be getting some silvers. With them silvers you can use them in the gold exchange and have a lot of profit. So you can go on the market and buy silvers or you can save up all the silvers like I always do. I never quick sell my silvers. I save them up because once golds are at a high point, you're going to be able to make a lot of stubs. Let's take a look at the market right now and see exactly what I'm talking about. Yeah, baby. <laughs> So let's look at the marketplace, go to live series. We're gonna filter between 82 and 84 overall. Now remember, all the silvers that you are saving up, you can go to the exchange, turn them into gold packs. That's gonna be a guaranteed gold every single time, okay? So you can either buy the silver players. If you are in my Discord, you already know exactly what I'm talking about. Or you can save all your silvers and turn them into triple profit. Okay, so if you look at the market right now, if you was to make a pack with 76s, it's going to take eight different cards. You can spend only 600 stubs to make a pack. Then you look at this Brandon Woodgriff. Okay, not the best card in the game, but if you spend 600 stubs and you pull this card, 1743 out of the gold pack, you do the math. That's a lot of stubs. That's about 11 to 1200 profit. Even if you pull this 84 overall Tyler Glass now, that's 1500 stubs. That's double your profit of the pack, or you're making all profit if you are saving all the silvers. Look at the Anthony Rizzo. If you got the silver saved up and you turn them into a gold pack, 1779 stubs you got. Emmanuel Classe, over 3000 stubs. You can make the pack for 600 or you can save the silvers and you got 3,000 stubs. Now think about this. If you have 60 to 70 different packs and you pull five or six of these, your stubs is gonna add up super, super fast, no money spent, unlimited stub method. Now on top of that, you also have roster investments that you can make a lot of stubs. So I spent 800,000 to complete the George Brett three days ago. I was down to about 15, a little over 20,000 stubs around there, okay? I grinded the mini seasons method, and then I got all the way back up in two days, probably five hours to 300,000 stubs. I took 20,000 of them 300,000 stubs, and then I invested. Oh, I got 13 class A's. That's a chance for 13, 85 overall diamonds in my binder, okay? $31.99 is his price. I can sell them right now. That's a lot of profit, especially if you're getting them for the free silvers that's in your inventory. Right here, Andres Jimenez. That's a chance for a plus two. That's two free diamonds. $24.19. If you're doing it off of the silver packs, that's a lot of profit. If you've been following the channel, Austin Riley, I got 60 of these. So at 3,000 stubs, that's over 130, 140 
thousand stubs. So Kenley Jensen, 84 overall. He's not over the 2,000 range, but right now he's over the quick sale. 84 overall, quick sales for 1,500. If you are making them for 600 stubs, or if you have a bunch of silvers and you open a gold pack and pull him, 600, 1200, 1800, that's triple profit on all the Kenley Jensen's that you have. So a lot of people will go like this and they will quick sell him for 1500 stubs. When you can go like this and just sell him off and have even more profit. So 1796, 1616, that gives you another 116 more stubs. Trust me, it adds up. Now, if you enjoy the small breakdown and you want more in depth, make sure that you are subscribed with your notifications on so when I'm streaming, you can ask me any kind of questions. All the OGs on the channel, what's up, man? And keep rocking, y'all. Let's get it.